Hey guys, it's Sai Savage OMG back with another video and today we are going to talk about all of us because I do understand that there is a lot of stuff going on about George Floyd and everybody, you know, uh, all that kind of stuff, you know. Um, I just want to say that, um, we all matter. Um, there's, you know, we, we do all have our flaws. We do have, yes, other people have, like, different skin, but that doesn't mean you have to, you know, go and make fun of them. You know, yeah, we do have different, they do have different hair, but that doesn't mean that you have to make fun of them and tell them that they have horrible hair. You know, I, I feel like we all matter. We all matter. There's not, there's not. I just wish in this world that there's not that much racism because, you know, and people think that people are dumb to be like friends with black people, but black people are awesome. Like they're not different in any way at all. They're the same kind of person, but different skin tone. It doesn't matter what color they are. It doesn't matter what eye color they have. It doesn't matter if they speak different. We're all a human being and we should all be treated with respect. Yeah, by the way, um, <laughs> if you hear noise in the background, it's the fridge. I'm literally in my, my grandma's downstairs kitchen and also my brother's playing video games. And yeah, we have a living room down here. Wow. Wow. It's bracelet. Anyway, so we all matter. Everybody's a human being. We need to be all, we not all need to be tr treated with respect. Sorry, I'm losing my voice here. <laughs> uh, so I just, I, I just thought I'd put it out there because, you know, we should be treated with respect because nobody's, nobody's different. Nobody's going to be the exact same person at all, you know, and so... I just feel like that dude who did that to George Floyd was wrong. Yeah, he was wrong in doing that action. Yeah, and he should get jail time. But that doesn't mean you need to go up in front of him and confront him about it. That doesn't mean you have to burn buildings about it. It doesn't mean you have to you know, go wreck cars or it doesn't mean you have to literally just burn down every single place in the United States because you're not going to get anywhere. You're just going to get yourself more upset or somebody else more upset than they already am. And this is just going to continue and continue until pretty much everyone dies because there's literally no point because I you're not you're not getting anywhere by doing that at all <laughs> literally you're not getting anywhere and so yeah i just i feel like i feel like we have all we have flaws and it's going to be that way not everyone is going to be the same exact person at all we're all going to have differences that's what makes, that. that's literally what makes you, you, is that you have something special that you like about yourself. Like, if you like, if you like being chubby like me, you be chubby, girl. If you like to play video games, you play video games. If you like to wear makeup, you wear makeup because... Everybody has something that they like about themselves. And if you put that down on them, and if you tell them that they're not going to do it, and that they're not going to achieve their goals, you know, they're probably going to go jump off a bridge and kill themselves. Do you want that for people? I don't think anyone wants that for anyone. And, you know, people, people like, from, from my, my perspective, can't talk <laughs> from my 
my perspective is the people who are always mean and bullies, you know, they get treated wrong. They get treated wrong. But that doesn't mean you have to go and treat other people wrong. You know, you don't have to go out there and you don't have to go tell someone that they're the, that they're a slut. Sorry I said that, but, you know, you don't have to go out in there and tell them that. Because if you go out there and treat someone, people are just going to say you're going to get the same way that you treated them back at you. Because you can't, the things you do bad come back at you at some time or at one point in your life. It's happened to me, you know. I get called names all the time. I get hurt, you know. And people wonder why I'm always sad or always depressed or always, you know, mad. But that's why is because you treat me bad. You know, you shouldn't treat someone bad just because they're different you know you're different too and is somebody calling you names no but that doesn't it just i don't get it at all what is the point what you're not gonna get anywhere by treating someone bad or treating anything bad like a dog or an animal or a person or someone who's disabled you know oh, yeah. people who are disabled already have go been going through th some things they have to deal with treatments they have to deal with surgeries they have to deal with people calling them names you know they're a human we all have our flaws I just hope that this will end. And I hope that everyone just, you know, knows that you shouldn't treat someone. Like if I, for example, if I was a bully, I was my brother, he was with Link, I don't know what that was. But what I'm trying to say, if a, uh, for example, if, like, I was a bully or, you know, if I was someone who was getting bullied, you know, I would say to their face, I would say, do you want to get treated that way? Just think if you were in that situation, what would you do, you know? You would probably, you know, like, I'm saying to the, I'm not saying, like, this is, like, a bad thing. I'm just saying you shouldn't treat anyone with, you're pretty much disrespecting them. Everyone de deserves res respect. Everyone does. Doesn't matter who they are, what they did. But, you know, doesn't mean you have to treat them bad. I just, I hope this changes everyone's decisions of what they're doing out there. You know what I mean? And, it, like, I'm speaking out. Because I made this YouTube channel because I I see other people, you know, I understand, like, you know, you see me on here and you, you think, oh, she has a perfect life. Oh, she, she does this, she does that. But we don't have perfect lives. There, you know, there shouldn't be a word perfect because there's literally nothing perfect about us. We're all different. We all have different things that we do. And we all have different lives, you know. And, you know, just because, just because I'm chubby and just because I have flaws doesn't mean that you have to make fun of me at all. Like, yeah, I, I know, like, I've been through it. I've been bullied. Like, I've been bullied. I'm going to say that. I'm, I've been bullied. You know, and it's sad. It is very, very, very sad. People think, oh, you have both of your parents. And I don't. I don't even have my dad or my mom. You know, and it's like, oh, hey, that girl looks gorgeous. And she's all pretty. She probably has the perfect life. No, I don't. 
at all. I don't. And I'm, I'm just speaking out there because I want everyone to know that everybody's different and you don't have to make fun of them. You don't have to choke someone because they're black. You do not at all. Is it going to get you anywhere? No, it's just going to get you in jail. And, you know, you don't have to go there and destroy a store. Destroy a store. You know where where it's going to get you? Nowhere. You're on, the only place you're going to probably go is probably either jail or you're probably going to get shot and dead. Literally, people are going out there and destroying cars and destroying houses and destroying stores. For what reason? Nothing. It's not a good excuse to do it. At all. Like, yeah, I would be, I would be mad about if, like, someone just, you know, someone choked someone for no reason. Like, yeah, he did counterfeit, like, a $20 bill. But that doesn't mean you have to put him in a chokehold and literally kill him. At all. It just, it, it doesn't, I, I just, I'm baffled, I'm speechless. And you know, I don't, I just don't get it. I, I don't know. It, it just gets us nowhere at all. You know, you're just going to get, because your, acts, your actions do speak louder than words. So if you say something. And then you don't do it, you know, like, they're not going to ask you to do it again. I know this has nothing to do with what I'm talking about, but you know what I mean. But, you know, I just thought I'd put this out there because people, people need to know that people are going through, through stuff. Like, people are, you know, I have this little saying is that your hand your wrist is not paper, so don't cut it. Your life is not a film, so don't end it. You know, your shirt is not a rope, so don't hang it. People need to stop bullying. People need to stop it. Because it's not going to get you anywhere. It's just going to get you in trouble. Because it's happened to me. I've, I've actually bullied other people. And I didn't notice it because, you know, I don't know. You know, I don't know right from wrong. Because I'm always in a household to where everybody yells. Everybody's mad at each other. You know, everybody gets aggravated. So every single time I'm like at another person's place, which, you know, as you see, I am at my grandma's. You know, when I make a mistake, I say sorry because I'm afraid I'm going to get in trouble. And it is sad. Just please, guys. Don't be a bully. Be someone kind like me. Because right now, I am proud of myself. Like, I'm not proud of my decisions that I make. Everyone, everyone makes mistakes. Everyone does. That's why I'm saying you don't have to confront that guy who killed George Floyd in the store because he made a mistake. And yeah, he probably regrets it. That doesn't mean you have to go in, in there and tell him. Tell them off because it's literally not going to get anyone anywhere except for just sadness and angriness. <sighs> yeah, I did just stretch. <sighs> I'm tired. It's like 7 o'clock at night right now. I ate pizza for dinner, by the way. <laughs> Not like you guys care at all, but just let you know. And so I'm just trying to make everyone aware that we all matter. 
then we all need to just stop doing what we're doing because there is no reason for you to go and put someone in the situation where they feel like they need to kill themselves. Because we all matter. We all have our flaws. You know, we everyone makes mistakes. You know, and everyone cries. Everyone, you know, has differences. So please, just think about, think about if you did someone, if you did something to someone, or if you need to like, go and apologize, do it. Or if you see them again, give them a hug and say sorry. You know, do something to fix your actions because it's just gonna haunt you forever and ever and ever. You know, it's just gonna be stuck in your brain. You're not gonna do something about it. You know, I I just wanted you guys to know. By the way, if you're new, my name is Cyrus. Um, oh yeah, I forgot I do have a TikTok channel. Yay! I forgot the name. <laughs> I forgot the name, but once I get the name, I'll put it in the link uh, in the description down below. I'll put the link to my channel so you guys can follow me because I have no followers. Because I got a new phone and then my account got deleted. Yay. Yeah, so. I will see you guys in my next video. Oh, by the way, if you are new hit that like button and hit that notification bell so you guys can get notified and uh, notified when i make new videos also if you're not new and you already seen my channels multiple times but you haven't subscribed yet please subscribe it would mean a lot to me um hit that notification bell also again and um yeah so I will see you guys in my next video. I just thought you guys wanted to know that we do all matter. We have our flaws. Everyone cries. So I just thought I'd let you guys know. I'll see you in my next video. Peace.